child actors who grew up and are popular actors today. Who here has been watching countless Korean dramas? If you're a K-drama addict like most of us, you've probably seen most of the people on this list. Let's all welcome the child actors and actresses, or better known as the nation's little brothers and sisters, who transitioned from their childhood roles to teenage high school students and now fully grown adults that are far off from the child roles they were once known for. Just a little disclaimer, if I happen to mispronounce the name of your favorite, please forgive me. Korean language is beautiful, but for myself, a little challenging. But like you all, I love dramas too. Number 1. Park Shin Hye First on the list is none other than Park Shin Hye. Who could forget the child actress from Stairway to Heaven, who is now in her 30s and one of the most popular adult actresses today? Known as the Queen of High School Dramas by K-drama fans, Park Shin Hye's career isn't going to end anytime soon. From the hit film Miracle in Cell No. 7, The Classic Prince Hours, The Heirs, Pinocchio, and Memories of the Alhambra, Park Shin Hye started as a child actress who continued rolling on our screens when she became a teenager. Now as an adult, she has become one of the most in-demand endorsers. Watch Park Shin Hye in her recent movie, Hashtag Alive, and movie Call, and upcoming drama Sisyphus, The Myth. Definitely love that Park Shin Hye's career is staying strong. Let's all celebrate by clicking that like button, lol. Number 2. Yoo Sin Ho Starting as a child actor in the 2002 film The Way Home, this angry little kid is now a full-grown man. The Way Home was a low-budget film, which unexpectedly became a box office hit and made Yoo Sin Ho be known as Nation's Little Brother. Since then, he continued appearing in dramas and movies like Immortal Admiral Yi Sun Shin. Queen Sonduk, Missing You, and Warrior Baked on Su. Now a grown man and done with his military service, our cute and innocent looking Yu Sun Ho has starred in dramas we've come to love, like the heartbreaking Remember, The Emperor, Owner of the Mask, the cute and romantic I'm Not a Robot, the high school drama My Strange Hero, and his latest drama Memorist. Number 3. Kim So Hyun. Known to many, Kim So Hyun is an actress who started acting at an early age, debuting at the age of 7 in Drama City. Kim So Hyun has had a huge career and is now known as the queen of high school dramas by many fans, replacing Park Shin Hye. Now 21, Kim So Hyun's career is so successful that her dramas have become hit after hit. Let's name some of the many dramas and movies she's been in. Moon Embracing the Sun Missing You Who Are You? School 2015 Pure Love, Hey Ghost, Let's Fight, Tale of Noctu, and Love Alarm. Did you know that she also hosts music programs and drama awards? Loving her growth in this industry, fans are patiently waiting for the second season of her Netflix drama, Love Alarm. Number 4. Kim Yoo Jung Debuting and acting at the early age of 4, Kim Yoo Jung was one of the most in-demand child actresses in Korea. After appearing in countless dramas and movies as a child, she grew up in front of our eyes with Dong Yi and Moon Embracing the Sun, and even hosted the music show in Kigayo. Kim Yoo Jung's popularity grew even more because of the historical drama Love in the Moonlight, where she was paired with Park Bo Gum. This historical drama was such a hit. Did you also get the Moonlight Syndrome and enjoy that little bit of gender bending? She truly is the Seiguk fairy everyone's been talking about. Now in her 20s, Kim Yoo Jung recently appeared in the 2020 drama Backstreet Rookie. Number 5. Yo Jin Gu Another popular actor today who started as a child actor is Yo Jin Gu. Because of his role in the film Sad Movie, Yo Jin Gu entered the world of entertainment at the age of 8, playing roles in the dramas Warrior Baked on Su, Moon Embracing the Sun, My Absolute Boyfriend, and The Crowned Clown. Yo Jin Gu has continued to put himself out there and improve on his acting, continuing to wow us with his acting skills. He gained more popularity in his recent drama, Hotel Da Luna, where he shared the screen with IU and received critical acclaim. Yo Jin Gu will be back on our small screens with the upcoming drama entitled Monster, which is set to premiere in 2021. Number 6. Nam Ji Hyun Starting her career way before her teenage years, Nam Ji Hyun is one of the actresses who transitioned well from being a child actress to now being the lead actress as an adult. As a child, she took part in projects like East of Eden and Queen Sonduk, rising in popularity and building a name for herself. She appeared in dramas such as Shopaholic Louie and Suspicious Partner. 
She also starred in 100 Days My Prince with EXO's Dio, where she gained more fans from her impressive acting and the drama's great story. Want to watch more of Nam Ji Hyun? Check out her latest work this 2020 in 365 Repeat the Year. Number 7, Lee Se Young. If you've seen the films When I Turn 9, Lovely Rivals, and The Wonder Years, you have surely seen Lee Se Young. Beginning her career as a child actress, Lee Se Young took on more roles when she entered her 20s. Want to know where you can watch her? Let's all watch her growth as an actress in Missing You. Hit the Top, A Korean Odyssey, and The Crowned Clown. Grateful she is still active in the film industry, Lee Se Young has provided us with more Korean dramas this year, namely Memorist and the ongoing drama Kairos. Number 8, Shim and Young. Sunny, Fabricated City, and Miss Granny are Korean movies we know so well. But how much do we know about the women who starred in these movies? Shim and Young is an actress currently in her 20s who debuted at the age of 9, gaining the attention of many. This actress became one of the best child actresses during her time, with her works like The Woman Who Wants to Marry, Hansel and Gretel, The Legend, and The Great Merchant. She truly improved on her craft over the years and even became the first Korean to take home the Best Actress Award at the Japanese Academy Awards. Saying hi to us this 2020, Shim and Young appeared on our screens in the new drama Money Game. Number 9, Go Asung. Remember the little girl in the blockbuster hit The Host? Guess what? She's in her late 20s already. Go Asung kept serving us great acting in projects like Snowpiercer, Master of Study, and Heard It Through the Grapevine. Go Asung first appeared in a commercial at the age of four, and ever since she took on roles that helped boost her career and further her acting journey. If you want to watch her recent projects, you can try watching the Korean drama Life on Mars and the films A Resistance and Samjin Company English Class. Number 10, Lee Hyun Woo. Another actor who we've seen grown up on television is Lee Hyun Woo. Starting his career at the age of 9, this 27 year old is still active in dramas, films, and even hosting. His career took off as a child actor, and you may have seen Lee Hyun Woo in The Legend and Queen Sonduk. This actor continued to build his career, playing a role in Master of Study and even hosting a music program. Wondering where you've seen Lee Hyun Woo? He played major roles in Secretly Greatly, Murum School, The Liar and His Lover, alongside Red Velvet's Joy. Lee Hyun Woo just completed his military service in 2019, so we are really excited to see him in the upcoming film entitled Dream. Number 11, Moon Gun Young. Another child actress who was referred to as the nation's little sister is Moon Gun Young. She played the young version of one of the characters in the well known drama Autumn in My Heart. And her success continued with her following works, such as A Tale of Two Sisters, My Little Bride, and Innocent Steps, which became hits. Last year, she gave us a television series titled Catch the Ghost. So, what will she bring us next year? Well, we can't wait for the dramas and films she'll be in in the future. Number 12, Kim se -ron. Showing up on our screens at the early age of nine, Kim se -ron made a name for herself by becoming a popular child star thanks to her roles in A Brand New Life and The Man From Nowhere. Growing up, she continued appearing in films and even starred in a drama series too. Kim se rongs great acting won her a Best Young Actress Award at the 2013 MBC Awards for her role in The Queen's Classroom. Everyone was in awe of her remarkable acting skills in A Girl at My Door, High School Love On, Manhole, Snowy Road, Secret Healer, and so many more. Number 13, Nam da -jun. Do you remember the child actor who played the young version of Kim Hyung Jun in Boys Over Flowers? Having a hard time remembering? How about Lee Jun Suk's younger version in Pinocchio and While You Were Sleeping? Yes, that is Nam da -jun the child actor who is now a teenager stealing our K-drama hearts. He isn't officially an adult yet, because a lot of you might look for this young actor who is in his final years of being a teenager. Playing a lead role in A Beautiful World and a small role in Hotel Da Luna, Nam Da Rim is a popular actor that everyone anticipates will become more famous when he grows up. Will he be on our list in the future? For now, let's watch this handsome young star play the younger version of one of the characters in Startup. Who among these actors have you seen in dramas during their preteen years? Let us know in the comment section down below. Thanks for watching, MDLers. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. I'm your host at Happy Squeak.